A technique that follows upon the implicit function theorem is called implicit differentiation. Well, consider the following example where we have the following equation x squared plus y squared equals 25. So this is basically the circle around the graph is uh, the curve is a circle around the origin with radius 5. Now 4.3 is on this curve. Now we want to uh, want to have the, uh, an equation for the line through 4.3 which is tangent to the circle in 4.3. Well there's a problem here. Uh, if we would know how to solve y in terms of x then we could possibly apply normal differentiation techniques but here uh, we face the problem that the equation uh, does not define y as a function of x. Right, so for most values of x in between minus 5 and 5, we have two values y corresponding to this one x value. Yeah, so that y is not a function of x. Yeah, so suppose on the left hand side we take some value x, then we see clearly that there are two corresponding y values. Well, one, one thing to overcome this problem is that we might zoom in on 4, 3. Right? So if we zoom in on 4, 3 like, the, like so, then we see that y actually looks like a function of x. And we are in the upper part, so we know that y of x equals the square root of 25 minus x squared, right? So if we're close enough to 4, 3, then we may solve y as a function of x. Well, this only holds around the point 4, 3. But now we have a regular differentiable function, y, at least as long as x equals is unequal to 5, so we use the chain rule for differentiation so y prime equals the derivative of square root of 25 minus x squared and you may deduce that this is the inner the the minus 2x which is the derivative of 25 minus x squared and divided by 2 times the square root of 25 minus x squared so substituting 4 which is the relevant x value returns the derivative minus 4 over 3 so that the uh, an equation of the line L equals y minus the y evaluated in 4 times the derivative in 4 times x minus 4 which equals so y equals 3 minus 4 over 3 times x minus 4 So even though we have an equation from which we cannot directly solve y in terms of x, by zooming in it is clear to which of the functions we are aiming and we may just use regular differentiation techniques to find a tangent line in some point to the curve.